Okay, this is a Mercedes CLA 250, uh, 2015. What happened was uh, somebody left it in four bricks about a week ago. Uh, basically, uh, he gave us a call and we suggested that uh, since he has the factory alarm, uh, you know, this is a lease and he's got about a year to go, so he didn't want to go out and put a full blown alarm system in with the text messaging and the whole nine years. Uh, what we end up doing is adding a shock sensor to the existing factory alarm that he has from Mercedes uh, And basically if anybody walks up uh, And jacks up the car because it has a tilt sensor and a shock sensor uh, They will, it will fire off the alarm system uh, I'm going to demonstrate that right now. Basically you hit lock the same way the, you've been doing as a Mercedes owner Kick the, door, the tires Fire off Turn it off, you're gonna hit unlock and that will turn off the alarm. Just the regular way that you were arming and disarming the, the, the factory alarm. The problem with these cars is uh, if you're wondering why did he have to do this if he already has an alarm, is because the factory alarm system do not come with any tilt sensors or any shock sensor for the impact. The only way it works is if somebody breaks the window, jumps in and opens the door and then, then the factory alarm will go off. But everybody that's targeting these vehicles know that too well. So they're not gonna open the door. They're gonna break the window and jump in and take whatever they need and empty you out or work on your airbag or your radio. Or they're gonna leave your car on four pavers uh, and take your rims and tires. Uh, so that's why we go ahead and add the shock sensor and the tilt sensor to the factory alarm system. That's what's installed here in Miami, Florida by Auto Alarm Specialist. Thank you for watching this video.